it would be easy to go, how are we going to be blokes? How are we going to be strong? How are we going to be tough? How are we going to be macho? Anne is um, an exuberant, ambitious spirit. Um, she doesn't just come in and set dances. She creates a whole tribe out of us. You have a chance to go, oh, I've been alive on this planet for this many years. I've done this many dance styles. I've done this much physical theater work. I've done this much um, Tai Chi. I've done this much martial arts. Which, which one of my toys would you like? And you want to provide each actress with, with exactly what she needs to achieve whatever it is the piece calls for. Anne is amazing. She is a pro at what she does. When it comes to sort of feeling the rhythm and sort of moving freely, I'm all right at that. But when it comes to sort of technical movements, that requires a little bit of work from my end because that's not my strength. But one of the greatest things about doing this project is it unleashes potential in you that you never really thought that you had. We've been working very much on our body language being quite neutral or wiping out the things that make us very girly and kind of sort of being more direct, strong, confident, all those things that we perceive in men. She's taught us as women, we use our hands a lot because we're always trying to modify what we say. We're trying to make it sort of all right when we talk by putting our hands in there just in case. Whereas if I put my hands down and I just talk to you without moving my hands, I think I suddenly feel more, I feel more powerful and I think you feel more threatened by me. When I was at drama school I used to love doing um, stage combat and all that and fighting. I'm just a bit of a tomboy and so actually when I became a professional actor, though I used to always end up being the person who would like get thrown across the stage or like be on the receiving end of a slap, but I'd never actually get a proper fight, you know, a proper choreographed fight um, until this, until I think it was actually in Julius Caesar, there's a big fight, Sin of the Poet, and, and through them all, yes, and, but particularly Hotspur, and it's just good, it's just good fun. She's there to release the potential in everybody and she does it with a joy and impatience and I think makes everybody leap higher, go faster, f just realise their potential in a way that um, they didn't expect. <laughs>